What's going on everybody? Welcome to CS5 Unmasked, bringing you another mask showcase video. Today I have four masks I want to show you. Now these are not my typical hockey masks. I actually purchased a bunch of airsoft masks and decided to paint them up. So the first mask here is going to be a zombie Captain America. I went online and I was looking at Captain America photos and a few Captain America zombie photos popped up. I was extremely intrigued and then I actually found out that it was actually based off of a comic book. So I decided to integrate that onto the airsoft mask. And in all actuality, I think it actually looks pretty good. Now the next mask I'm going to show you was actually my first airsoft mask I ever got. So I decided to do something simplistic by just doing a half and half paint theme. One half is a blood red with extensive damage, and the other half is just a gloss black. Even though it's so simplistic with just two colors, I think it turned out pretty cool. So after staring at this mask for a little while, it kind of makes me want to do a Deathstroke mask. Alright, the next mask here is going to be no surprise to anybody. This is my version of the Deadpool mask. I decided to go with more of like a candy apple red with a gloss black because I really wanted it to stand out. But what I will do if I decide to make another Deadpool mask, I will dirty it up a little bit. Or heck, maybe I'll just turn him into a zombie like I did Captain America. Because let's be honest, who doesn't want more zombies? I know I do. Alright, now the final mask here is my rendition of the Harley Quinn mask from the Suicide Squad. Now I was going to make the mask just solid white and then do the color variations but it looked too clean. So I went in and I dirtied it up just a little bit and I think it turned out a little bit better. Now if I do decide to make this mask again, I will focus more on the pink and the blue on the eyes so they could really stand out. But overall, I think the mask did turn out pretty good. All right, I hope you guys really enjoyed the mask because I really liked making these and I do plan on making more in the future. So if you guys have any suggestions for future airsoft mask paint designs that I could do, leave them in the comments below. All right, everybody, this is CS5 signing out, and I hope to see you in the next video.